Good morning guys, so today is moving day. Well, we have to be out of this apartment by tomorrow. And crazy twist of events, we don't even know where we're moving to. Um, we were gonna mo move into my husband's mobile home that he's been flipping, but last minute we found out that is not gonna be ready for us, so our family is kind of in a really weird situation. We literally applied a few days ago for a house to rent with three bedrooms, um, but we are waiting to hear back if we are approved. Hopefully he gets back to us today. Um, <laughs> so it's just really crazy. So either, I mean, we have a place to go. If we get approved today, we'll move into, start moving into that house. And if we don't get approved, we will be moving into Daniel's aunt's fully furnished basement and storing all of our stuff while we look for another house. So I feel like I should be more stressed and I am... I am tired. Marcus is sick. I'm also a little bit sick. I've had a sore throat for a couple days and a really stuffy nose. Um, so last night I didn't sleep well. Marcus kept waking up last night. And I feel like I should be really stressed. <laughs> but God is good. And I kind of almost feel like I'm not really... I don't know. I just really feel like I'm not really feeling the stressed and anxiety emotions that I sh could be. <laughs> so anyways... Um, yeah, and I even though I only got like a few hours sleep last night, I actually feel pretty good. I'm going to try to get a nap later today if I can. But Daniel is out getting us coffee because, yeah, like I said, rough night last night. We need coffee. So these are all empty boxes. Marcus is, like I said, he's sick. So he's sitting on his little rocking chair, rocking horse, watching Veggie Tales. So sweet. Um, anyways, everything's kind of a mess. We've already packed up pretty much the whole kitchen and that is packed in a trailer that we have outside. And Daniel has some friends coming over this afternoon to help load up all the furniture. I just hope that we have a place to put it <laughs> by tonight. We do have a little food left in the kitchen so I think I'm going to go get myself some cereal, some granola, and then enjoy my coffee when it gets here. And how cute is this little angel? She's such a sweetie. Coffee's here. <laughs> I like how you're carrying it. <laughs> oh, we should have thought of getting him something. Do you want some coffee? No, Mama will make him a hot chocolate. Oh, he loves daddy. <laughs> he loves daddy. Look, he's just trying to crawl up me. Oh, so sweet. No, Marky. Literally about 45 minutes ago, we found out that we got approved for the rental house, so sigh of relief. It's really nice to know we have somewhere to move. Daniel's really happy. Very happy. I can't tell if I'm filming you or not. Baby girl just wants to be held by mama, which is so sweet. I look so tired. I did not get a nap today. Um, it was kind of silly to think I would. But anyways, so we have people coming in about 15 minutes to help us move, so we're just going to try to get everything done and over. Everything is pretty much packed except for our clothes and our bed, um, and the rest, or like our bedding, and the rest is furniture. So we'll, we'll go there, set up just what we need to, you know, get through the night, and then tomorrow we'll be all unpacking. And depending on how long this vlog is, I might vlog a little bit of unpacking, but We'll see. We'll see if she lets me. She's such a sweetie. Oh, oh what's wrong, oh. honey? Are you tired? Tired and you can't get to sleep? Tired and you can't get to sleep? You're oh. such a cutie. Oh. She's so sweet. I can't get over how tired I look. I really, like the last two nights, because Marcus has been sick. It's like everything's happening to us this weekend. Isn't that how it always is? But, um, 
because Marcus is sick. I've been waking up every hour or couple of hours. Pretty much every hour because I am out with him and then I get him settled down and then she starts crying and it's time to feed her and so that's why my under eyes look the way they do. That's mom life, right? I'm just gonna leisurely unpack and just take it easy because I'm so tired. <laughs> And, um, but I'm not stressed at all, which is really nice, because I've heard that moving is one of the most stressful things to do, and I'm really not stressed. And now that we know we have the house, I actually kind of feel excited about moving, because we're going to have a house for a change, and a backyard for Marcus, and I'm just so excited for that. He really needs more space to play. Anyway, so I'm going to get this girl to sleep take a little nap and we're gonna continue packing. Hi baby girl. Oh baby girl. Did you enjoy sleeping in your new house? Yeah? You wanted to nurse all night didn't you because you're in a new place. Such a sweetheart. So we got here last night about 8 o'clock 8 30 and just set up the beds really quick and now this morning we've been pa unpacking just bringing stuff into their proper rooms and it's going pretty well it's just kind of chaotic um, and I forgot to in the vlog last night so I thought I would take you guys through today so it's kind of slowly getting there we've been working on it for a couple hours now here's the living room we set this up because Marcus wanted to watch video shows um, so there's our fireplace there's Marky back there, and yeah, things are going really well. I didn't film myself earlier because I was quite a mess, so now I'm a little bit more presentable for the day. But um, we're on our way to the apartment again to do a little bit of cleaning because we left it. We were just in such a hurry to just move in and sleep in the new house that we left this apartment really messy, and we're going to check the mail and stuff. But little Chloe is here in the back seat and we are meeting some friends over there to help us clean Daniel's driving and Jason's in the front seat and he's single <laughs> and yeah so we're just gonna go over there and do a little cleaning and hopefully it doesn't take very long I forgot to mention what I was gonna talk about Did you see this hun? What? That is three women driving that truck in an F-350 with smokestacks and a trailer. Oh, so, I can't even see it. So you awesome. can totally hear how much I'm seeing the footage of this. So I don't know why we need to see this, but... Like, yeah, does this impress you, honey? I mean, it's just, that's, that's cool. Anyways, I was going to talk about our night last night. So, Marcus was getting really cranky and baby was crying and my whole drive home was two crying babies in the back seat. It was not very fun. But um, we got there, Marcus got like a second win. He got super excited to look at all the stuff in the new house, to explore the backyard. But then it was time to go to bed and he would not go to sleep in his new room. Oh no, don't cry baby Chloe. He would not go to sleep in his new room. So I brought him into ours because I didn't want him to be scared in a new place. So we had the pack and play in our room and we had Chloe, but they kept crying. One would cry, wake up the other one, he would cry and just going back and forth and it was miserable for probably about an hour. So we all got up and ate a snack and then my mom got up too and we all ate cereal in the kitchen together. But then she said that she would take Marcus into her room and he did end up going to sleep and having a much better night. So he's at home napping with grandma. Uh, so I'm hoping he gets more used to his room and sleeps better in there tonight because I think that tonight is the night that we all need to just get some good sleep. Um, but yeah, after after he went to bed with Grandma, we did get some decent sleep. So anyways, that's what I wanted to talk about. Our first night in our home was not the most fun. Goodbye, old house. You've been good to us. Hey guys, I forgot to end the vlog last night, so I'm just gonna wrap it up really quickly. Now it's Sunday, and um, 
we had a much better light night last night. I got a lot more sleep, which is really, really nice. And today we've kind of been just chilling and doing a little here and there. Um, so we do have a little bit left to do. We haven't hung curtains or anything like that, but we are really enjoying being in a house now. Um, we are renting, but it is so nice to not be in an apartment anymore. I'm loving it. And I think that Marcus having a backyard would be really, really great for him. Anyways, once we do get completely settled in, I will be doing an official house tour for you guys. Um, but I do, I mean, obviously there's more space in here now, so there are some things that I want to get before showing you guys the completed house tour. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching our moving vlog. I hope that, uh... I hope that you guys are all having a great evening wherever you are. I'm going to go and heat up, reheat my tea for the third time today and check on Marcus. I think he is not doing so well over there. Anyways, I'll see you guys in my next vlog. Bye.